There's so much going on. Yes, I'm so happy. Okay, I need to turn this off. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm so excited to share with you my little first home shopping haul. If you know me, you know I love organizing, I love designing and creating, and for me this is so much fun to shop for. So if any of you are maybe moving out, maybe you're about to have your first dorm, um, I hope this can help you in some way. And yeah, let's get into the video. So starting with Target, the first thing I picked up was this marble little utensil holder. Um, I just, I just want to keep everything really crisp and clean looking. And there is a little bit of like a marble thing going on already. So I'm going to put that away. Another thing I picked up a bunch of was cute little plants. Like I told my boyfriend, he was like, don't be getting things we don't need. I was like, plants are necessary. Okay. Uh, I got this one. This is the only one I didn't get from Target. I got this one from Home Goods. Um, this one's going to go in the bathroom. This one's from Target. I think this one I'm going to keep in the kitchen. And then also this I got from Target to just kind of, ooh, it's so tall. I want to keep most of the things in here really clean and white, but then also have little pops of green to make it look really fresh. So, put that away. Along with the marble trend, I have, um, I also got a little trash can that's marbly, and I like that it's like very soft marble. I think it's really easy to make marble look cheap. It needs to be really soft to make it look a little more realistic. So that's the other one I got. So that's for the bathroom, actually. Also, this is just for inspo. I picked up the home edit book. This, oh my gosh. There's so many, like, organizing makes me so excited. Like, does, does organizing make you guys excited? Am I weird? I'm kind of thinking about printing some of these pages out so that my boyfriend can get the vibe of what I want, you know? Men, our men need direction. They don't understand sometimes, so I'm gonna make it very clear. This is what I want, babe, this. The home edit goes in and organizes a bunch of celebrities' houses, so you'll see, like, one of them was like Thomas Rhett, just really random um, people. So, just to give you an idea. Another thing I really liked is they left a little place in the back where you, um, like little stickers for your produce, snacks, fruit to put in your fridge. So I'll definitely be using that once we figure out how we're going to organize everything in the fridge. Also, just some basic stuff we picked up were some hand towels and um, like a little kitchen cloth. This one's kind of like a gold print. Um, so yeah, just some basics. Gotta have towels and things to clean. I think this might be one of my favorite, other than the plants, because it's like plants are the best. I really like this little bath mat we got. It's kind of woven, a little bit of a boho vibe, but still really, really clean and chic. Another thing I got were some Lazy Susans because in that home edit book, um, there's a lot of like Lazy Susans that she used for either spices or under the sink for your beauty stuff. It's just nice that you can kind of like go through your stuff. Um, I'm going to definitely use one for my beauty stuff. I'm probably going to go pick up even more of these because I also want this for like my olive oil and all my different spices and things like that. Okay, now I want to move into what I picked up from Ross and Home Goods, those kind of stores. Um, yeah, so for bathroom curtains. Oh, wait, did I pick up too much? No, that's good. Um, the fun one I got is just like this palm design. Yeah, this is going to be like my more fun bathroom, bathroom curtain. And then my more like adult bathroom curtain. I just got a plain white one that has a little bit of texture. If you're going to do something plain, at least make sure it has some texture to it. So I really like this. Yeah, I definitely want one of the bathrooms to have a hotel vibe and then the other one be a little bit more fun. And maybe like a boho fun vibe, you know? Um, ooh, also another really good thing I got were... So I found these Rachel Zoe wine glasses, needed to get wine glasses, that was a necessity, but I got these Rachel Zoe wine glasses, 
and I was looking at packs of wine glasses on Amazon before and the cheapest I could find of these kind was like 30 or 40 dollars and I got this whole pack for like 10 yeah it was 10 dollars and then also if you're moving out I think you have to get some fun soap so I got this one to go in one of the bathrooms and then if you know me Ever since I was little, I've always loved putting lemon soap in the kitchen, so I got this big one. Oh no, your soap can definitely add a lot of spunk to the room, so yes. I got a peony scented candle from Trader Joe's, and it's made with natural soy wax. It smells so good, so I'm going to light this ASAP. And then this stuff isn't as fun, but... These are things you need on your first shopping trip. So I'm gonna include some of the boring stuff. But I saw this at Costco and I thought this was perfect because you know when you want to cook a bunch of stuff and you're making veggies, chicken nuggets, a bunch of things all at once, you can do chicken in one pan and you can put your veggies in the other one and season them differently. I just thought that would be really handy. I want one of the bathrooms to just be like a very hotel vibe. So I just got a bunch of white towels from Costco because they're super cheap. And another thing that's kind of boring, but this was a really good deal if you have a Costco. Um, I got like 50 of these hangers, I want to say for like $12. That was a really good deal as well. So. One last thing um, from Amazon. I think this is such a clever idea, especially if you're going to be in college and you need to kind of keep all of your stuff in a small area. This little bag makes doing your laundry really easy. It will separate your lights, darks, and colors for you. And what I would do, because when I was living at home, I like to do my own laundry and I don't want anything to get messed up, like anything to get, be put in the dryer or anything like that. But this is really handy that you can just put everything in here and just carry it around and it's already organized for you. So yeah, I like that you can just dump this into the washing machine. As soon as something's clean, you can put it back in the clean section and then the other ones are kept dirty. You're not just putting it all in the same basket. So I thought this was very handy. Guys, that was everything for today's video. I'm just in such a good mood. I'm, a, I'm gonna go put all this stuff away and don't forget to like and thumbs up and subscribe. I'll see you guys in the next one.